started. It's Wednesday. Some possible uh, McFarland flash figures here. All right. Let's see what we do and find or don't find. All right. So it looks like they restart on her and a Loki. A couple of Lokis. Pretty cool. Power Rangers. Got no Batman stuff. No Spin Masters. We do have Transformer as well. Which is cool. Cheetor. Skull Cruncher. So these are new. Here's the barcode. DPCI is going to be different. Um, it's Rhinox and Skull Cruncher. Was not expecting any Batman stuff or Flash movie stuff, but figured I'd take a chance. But we're going to check the other corner or the other side and see what they got. Alright, same as usual, nothing too exciting. Everything's the same. Uh, wrestling the same, Star Wars the same, Motu the same, and all this, yeah, all the same. So nothing new here, nothing new here. Um, Hot Wheels look the same. So yeah, nothing new. Alright, let's go check Mr. Funko. All right, I see Groot and a whole bunch of new pops. So they got all the Groot pops. Pretty cool. More Avatar exclusive Hamilton. But that's all I see right now. Check the NECA section here in a minute. Um, these are six eighty nine. Weird. But anyway, hang tight. We're at Walmart. It is Thursday. About to go in see what they got. If there's anything new, I don't know. Let's go see. All right, we're in here with this loud ass music. I'm not expecting anything new. We got. Yep. Nothing. Damn it. Let's see. No, 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 no wrestling. These are 20 bucks at freaking Target. Walmart, why can't you just lower the price on these? Got all these freaking Adam pages clogging up freaking pegs. Beast Boy's still here. Um, Star Wars, yeah, I was really hoping for some Flash Spin Master stuff, but non-existent. Aquaman, Black Manta, there's a Beast Boy right here, Dre, I know you want that, I will get this for you, just hang tight, man. Marvel Legends, man, they even have an old Black Panther. What the heck? Yeah, there is literally nothing here. Um, I really wish they'd put this on clearance. And the Killer Croc book back there. But, damn. Okay. And we got over here. Put the ATAT up, -AT. Oh, still here. I gotta grab that, I think. 
Probably not today, but I am going to have to grab that. Uh, but yeah, nearly nothing new. I mean, I wasn't ex really expecting anything. I was hoping. I got Michelangelo. Starscream still here. So new, no new Transformers. Okay. Well, it looks like we're going to have to... Anything else? Oh, I'm not gonna go to the Funko NECA section because it just sucks. But this is cool. 1971 Porsche. Son collects these. I know he's gonna watch this. He's probably gonna want me to pick it up. That's all they have. This is it. Dang it. Okay. So this video is going to have to come out much later. Uh, yeah, I don't see anything else. I know there's a Porsche version of these coming out. But I don't see it. Kind of bummed this is the only one we have. Hmm. Alright, we're going to get out of here. We're probably going to go to Target or pick up Chipotle. And then gotta move on with the rest of the day so we'll see you guys at target all right there's literally nothing about walmart kind of expected um what about you guys with walmart's how are you guys with walmart's doing you know some people are finding the across the spider verse marvel legends which is what i'm looking for i have yet to find them so i might have to do a little traveling here um, i might have to go to the honey hole maybe a different one who knows but, Target, here we come. We're here to seek and destroy. And to pick up twice. Let's go. All right, right into the main toy aisle. Oh, someone bought all the Transformers. I've got this one still. Optimal, Optimus Primal and Skull Cruncher. Kind of cool. I don't know. Looks kind of cheap. No freaking other multiverse. Oh, look at this. They finally put these on sale. Thank God. Plenty of Duke and Rams. Wait till those go down a little more. Power Rangers. You got your Marvel Legends. Still the same. It's good to see these two at least. Oh, they have two of him, uh, three of him. Army Builder. I'm waiting one more time until they clean some more. We got not much on this side. That is kind of cool. Indiana Jones, is it what they got? And then Demon Slayer. Looks like not one, only one of them got bought. Interesting. Didn't realize that was going to be the popular one. We got Evil Lynn. $10.99. Got your Landos. I know these are on clearance, your Andors, and it looks like it. Got your He-Man, is it Frost is still back there? Gonna wait till it hits a little bit lower, if it does. Then we've got the Banshee, Jake Sully's Banshee. Thing's cool. I'm really surprised that's not, that's not on clearance. I'm waiting for that to go clearance. Hey Brad. And Hot Wheels. Not much. Okay. Well, Target is a bust. Let's go check the neck of Funko. Alright, we went through the pops. I wasn't gonna grab this, even though I've got three packs, but the box is damaged. 
Uh, this is unclaimed for five ninety nine, and you need this, so we're gonna grab that. Um, it's like the second time I've seen this here. So pretty cool. We have slash and rent it. Um, definitely cool. Not for me. Not a troll collector, but still cool to see. And besides that, nothing new. I have this, which is out of their inventory, 689, but don't need it, I already have it. <clears throat> and then we got this disaster, which I'll be cleaning up for here in a minute. And yeah, that's gonna be it. There ain't nothing else going on here. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel. On the road to 1K subs. We're only uh, full, I'm trying to think, less than 500 away. So I'm currently like at 533 subs. We're almost there. I'm trying to get that goal before my birthday in June. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, see you guys soon. All right, we're in Anderson Walmart. We're gonna see if they have anything new. I'm having a feeling they don't, but we're gonna check. First off, first pass at clearance. Does not look like anything. Probably should have bought the oh never mind beast wars <laughs> i'm gonna yeah <sighs> anyway let's uh i'll show you what's what's going on in the clearance sec all right besides this terrible thing, all this he-man stuff that no one wanted superpowers i was going to buy this but i'm gonna wait Oh, these are 10 bucks. It's all the same one, isn't it? Eh, 10 bucks. Cards are kind of shitty. So that's not going to happen. I have 19. Oh, actually, you know what? I will probably buy this. $11. Yep, and I'll probably buy Skelagon because I never got him. And it looks pretty cool. So we'll probably grab one of these. I'm gonna grab a Black Panther for $11. Like, why would I not? So, good, 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 good. They have these, which I could really care less about. What do they got here? Another Lando, another Lando. Okay. So now that we've gone through the clearance section, there's not really anything. Um, got more stuff over here. Oh, flower bouquet, 40 bucks. That's a good deal. Nine dollars. These are five bucks. This makes me think that they went through their toy section and put out new stuff. This is a deal. 40 bucks. Pretty sure this is more than 40 dollars. Hmm. I don't know. Let's go look at the main toy aisle now. Alright, main toy aisle. You got your Mario, your Sonic stuff, Bakugan, very loud father on the other side with his kid. No G.I. Joe, anything exciting. More AEW, same old, same old. I really wish this was cheap. We've got. We still have our Andor stuff. Yeah. Got your wrestling, WWE stuff. It's just packed full of stuff up there. Um, multiverse, DC multiverse, the same old stuff. We got Red Skull. Would like to find another Howard the Duck. 
as a Jimmy Woo. And then all your Guardian stuff, which has not sold yet, which is interesting. And the Snow Speeder, that's, I think this is new. I'm pretty sure that's new. And nope, Spider Man stuff. Oh man, I was really hoping they had like Spider Man. They knew it across the Spider Man stuff. But it's not lost. We're going to pick up some stuff on clearance. That's a good thing. Yeah, I don't see anything really worth picking up. Guardians of the Galaxy wave. I'm going to wait. Uh, they're going to be everywhere soon. This is tempting. And it looks like Black Manta is gone. Oh, wait, never mind. I don't know. This looks good. So and I guess uh, we'll hit up the NECA Funko section since there's really nothing in Transformer land here. Yeah, nothing. Bummer. This is a bummer. All right, let's hit the NECA Funko. All right, our standard end cap full of nothing. Okay. Let's see. Nothing. Got Ted Ned. That looks like it. Oh, well, let's see if they have anything over here. I'm gonna say, yeah, hey, Jack, anything. Yeah, nothing. These Walmarts have been super disappointing lately. Oh, they have the uh, Earth Day 2023 Care Bear. I Care Bear, that's funny. But as far as everything else, there is. Yep, nothing. So I'm gonna the heck out of here. I'm gonna go grab some clearance stuff and I don't know what the day holds. We will see. Let's go get some stuff. All right, we're outside of Ross, so we're gonna go in here and see if they, I don't know, got anything new since the last time I was here. Um, I don't know. I know Art went to his and he had no luck. So uh, let's uh, cross some fingers and hope for something good. All right, so we got some transformer stuff, which has been sitting here. Not seen. Oh, we got the putty still here, which is shocking. We have My Hero Academia. Like statues. Uh, there's a couple of those. $7.99. That's uh, that's tempting. As far as over here, we have the Halo stuff, Fortnite, another Transformer junk heap. We got yep, Black Lacnia. No more Marvel Legends. So those are pretty much gone. Here's a Fortnite set. Um, ten bucks. That's pretty good. Ten bucks. You can do customs. That's crazy. Ten dollars. So if you're into customs, look for the truck. We've got some Spider-Man stuff. Hot Wheels, more Transformers. Oh, not seeing really anything else. Sorry for the music. I'll probably have to edit that out. I've got your Star Screen, Coronation Star Screen. Still. Twenty two ninety nine, not a bad deal. Given that was like fifty or sixty bucks. 
Um, let's see all the elves. This music's really, really freaking annoying. I'll tell you that much right now. Yeah, there's nothing else. On this end, nothing really. Yeah, right here. Cyber adventures. Nothing exciting. Bunch of nothing. Yeah, <laughs> that's fun. Back in the day. Quarter stuff stuff there anymore. That's cool. Wolverine 2020 Corvette Stingray. We have a In Space Phantom Ranger. I know Art, I think, bought this to Army Build. I mean, you can literally make this anything you want. It doesn't even have to be for the Power Ranger set. Um, let's see. I'm not seeing anything else. Oh. Don't see much. Dinosaurs. Yep. Nothing else, guys. Bummer. Nothing new here. And then all the uh, White Rangers are gone. It's three ninety nine. dollars was a good deal. Looks like we're gonna pass on everything else here. Probably gonna pass on this puppy, which I feel like I'm gonna regret. <sighs> I don't know. I have to come back. We have to think about that one. Probably gonna hit up my other Ross and the uh, bargain place that we have here. See if there's anything new. Yeah, that's it. Nothing else. All right. I haven't been to this place in a while. Walgreens. Let's see if they well, we'll go together. have or don't have, I guess. Clean stuff, nothing. Over here. The Flash. We got Hot Wheels. Nothing too exciting there. This is Leia, the Flash, some pops. That's it. Damn. Why, why I don't come here anymore? Oh, here's some more. Oh, we do have this red alert that my son wants. We got Ella Bloodstone. Oh yeah, they have pops. I said something. Brother or Doctor Voodoo. We got Long Shot, Hercules, Jubilee, and Omega Red. Oh, man, it's too bad this wasn't on sale. Well, at least they still have it. Cool. All right, the hunt continues. On to the next. We are in Red Bluff. i check out this Ross for anything. See if there's anything new or exciting here. Let's go. Alrighty. See all of these little, all of these Titan heroes. Let's see how Jurassic Park, we have a Miles. Pokemon, Power Ranger Dino Fury, um, another Velociraptor, Pokemon. This is pretty cool. We saw this at the other Ross. More Pokemon. There's that cool Fortnite. You can custom. Penguin. Yeah, it looks like this is a bust. Nothing 
Transformers. Better Cybertron. Masters of the Universe. And just a bunch of cars. We got one here. Anything? Fortnite. Transformers. Bunch of Nerf guns. Statue. Yeah. box. RC All the stuff we've seen. Okay. Oh. Nothing else to see. On to the next. Alright. Let's get into it. Yeah. Here we are. The toy aisle. What do we got here? Anything? Anything? That's cool. Transformers. Crank case. It's all the same stuff I think we've pretty much seen. Dead end. Actually. Dead end. That one's new. Cool. Turtle stuff. I'm gonna skip past dinosaurs. Oh, they dude. They did have these. Oh, Spider Man 2099. The only Walmart in my areas that has toys. Alright, let's take a good look. I don't know, this looks pretty good. So does this Jessica Drew. I wasn't too sure, but it looks pretty good. I'm definitely gonna have to buy these. I'm glad they went with these retro carded, but I'm kind of pissed off that they didn't do include a build a figure, but I get why, because it's a, a, a retro card, because they don't do those on retro cards. But it's awesome. Um, don't see any more though. So I'm assuming they got bought up. So pretty cool. I'm gonna take a uh, photograph here. And we'll move on to more toy hunting. Alrighty then. Marvel Legends, got some old stuff, we got Jimmy Woo, we have Iron Man, um, what we got here, He Who Remains, nothing new here, a Clarence Jake Jonah from the Far From Home Wave, we have tons of multiverse, oh and here's a Howard the Duck, which you don't see very often. We might have to buy an extra one of those to build another conchu. I wish it was on clearance. What do we got here? There's Batman, Duke Thomas. Just a bunch of old stuff. Gotta reach up here. Okay, Red Skull. Scarlet Witch, and more Wakanda Forever, Wonder Woman, that nobody wants, dang, got that Frankenstein, Duke Thomas, Duke Thomas, Batman, Go label Catwoman. They have no new multiverse. 
We have on the back there. Jonathan Kent. Look at all this. Old stock. And then the side of Mongol. Okay. Six Superman. All the Black Adam stuff. Star Wars. Bang on Sinai. Shoot. Yep, all those Star Wars figures are gone now. Got chases. Oh. I need to grab one of these. I'm gonna leave these are bad. Look at this card. <laughs> it's a clean card. I definitely need two of them though. Oh, they even have a stinkler back there. It's awesome. Alright. Well, and there's a whole bunch of stuff up here. Stratos, which I don't have. Jiu-Jitsu, Sorceress, Beast Man. Man, there's all kind of stuff here. Oh. The Chase and Non-Chase. This thing got freaking rated. Some MJF. Kenny Omega. Mr. Brody Lee. It. And we have the snake eyes, but it's not clearing here. Jay Jr. Oh, they finally have Destro. This is cool. pretty cool. Hate the card backs. Right. This is new. Punk. Tiantina. Ghost. Cool looking. And that's it there. Okay. Oh, RC. What are you looking for that? Weren't you looking for this? I had it. Oh. That's funny. Okay. Well, let's go look at the clearance. And yeah, let's go check out clearance. All right, we found some more clearance. My favorite movie and the freaking figures that don't go away. Pretty yeah, the whole wave. We got Thor. Yeah, all Eternals, all Eternals, all the time. Look at all this. <laughs> all right, moving on to more clearance. Spinning into clearance. We got your Parasaur for 11, Wolfgang for 19, Retracts for 19. We got some WWE stuff. Got your Marvel Legends, which are Miss Mark 2497. Got three and three quarter inch still. Nine dollars is way too much. Fortnite. Um, your Ecto one for 35, way too high. That 17. I just picked this up for 12 bucks. A different Walmart. Four Love and Thunder, everyone's favorite movie. That's a joke. We got Pantor for 17. I still need that. And this is 1351. That's pretty cool. I still have three of those. And they have to come back again. And a bunch of girl stuff. We got Optimus Primal, still for 40. Lego. 
There's some more. Pterodactyl guy. They've got rat trap for ten bucks. Oh, here you go. Iceman for five. High Ubo Evolutionary for nine. That's actually a good deal. Wouldn't mind having another one of these to open. Boxes rush the she is. Then you got your stalkers for $7.29. And then you got Shuri for $19. Doctor Strange for $17. Valkyrie for $17. Cool. Well, that is it for clearance. We're going to get the heck out of here and we're going on the road. We'll see you in Chico Target next. Look at this. Von Leo. Just sitting here hanging out all by the bike helmets. We're at Chico Target. Let's see what they have and what they don't have. So obviously they have a bunch of pop. Amazing Spider-Man. Tom Holland Spider-Man. Tom Holland Spider-Man. And they actually have the Wonder Car. Wasp, Zeus, we got Wasp, Black Light, 599, Aliens, Green Goblin, Pennywise, Leatherface, and we got all this neck of goodness. Let's see what we can find. Got Mass Ronin, ET, it, black and white Dracula. And dropped it. <laughs> this looks good. Freaking glare. All the thong stuff. Got it. Got it. Scalp predator. I don't think I've seen this one. Oh yeah, I've seen it. Oh, that's cool. Got all kinds of stuff. Dracula, turtles. Check this out. Don't see that often. Lena and Scoobos. Ships. Now check this. See if that's on Cleavance. Um, well, that's pretty much it. Some other plushies. Check this hell out on Main Toy Alright. $18.99. Originally $37.99. So, not bad. Not bad. Alright, gonna go to the toy, uh, the Main Toy aisle. Here in a minute. Alright, so I'm another model kit. Let's see what this one is. Oh, that one's on, so damn it. Alright, moving on. Alright, then we get into the main toy aisle. They have one of these left. So we're gonna see. That's on clearance. Look at that. They have the Luca, the Condo, Duke Thomas Hush. Still have, damn, they still have these. That's funny. But yeah, this is the Chico Target. Toy small. 
We have wet Loki, he who remains, 750. Got all your Mario stuff. Poppy Playtime. Your eggs. Mm -hmm. Alright, moving on. Wrestling. Chase? Chase? Nope. One Star Wars. So the John Cena is eighteen sixty nine. Randy Orton is ten ninety nine. We know that these ones are on clearance. Some more of those troopers. Mechanic. Frost the ten ninety nine. Church and Sue. Stress. Same stuff as before. We got ten and two. And that is it. Maldoon for fifty percent off. Ray Arnold for seven fifty. They have Donatello and Raphael. Interesting. That is it. This one, this target is not that great. Pretty much like mine. Mine's have been pretty crappy too. But I'd see what other stores do have and don't have. Alright, let me check out what else they got. Alright, so I found this end cap. So let's see this first. Then Skeletor. What the heck? 9.89? Dude, what the hell? 9.89. I have to grab that for sure. I'm gonna show prices on this. And this end came up 22. So I'm grabbing that. We'll check that and we'll double check that. So let's go do that. Okay. Ooh, let's drop this. Nine forty four. No. I said Skeletor. Yep, nine eighty nine. How crazy. Nine forty four. That's 989. I already have it. I don't need it, but it's a good deal. That's a good deal. Alright. I think we're done here. Moving on to the next place. Alright. Burlington Coat Factory is what I know it as. So we're in Chico, California. So we're gonna check this Burlington. See what kind of goodies they may or may not have. No chasers. I don't even have a price. Spin Master stuff. Oh man, they have all kinds of stuff in here. I mean, not a lot of stuff, but got these crappy transformers. We got Lego, Black Panther, Infinity Saga, $12.99, not a bad deal. What else we got here? We got that Fortnite truck, Titan Series, Black Adam, more Black Adam stuff, more oh. dinosaurs, Nerf stuff. Spider-Man out. What is this? The Mission Fleet. We got Punk Ops. Mandalorian stuff. Yep. Really not much. I've only been to this one at a time and they didn't have anything then, but they have a way bigger toy section than my Burlington. So it's kind of nice to come here, check it out. More Funk Ops, Bush Ranger, and that is it. Dang. And we got a bunch of plushies, girl toys. Okay. Well, yeah, what do we got here? 
Oh, storm shadow. Yeah, that is it. All right, well, let's get out of here. Hey guys, T3 here. I'm back home from the long journey of the day. Started out going to Red Bluff, and that was supposed to be the only stop that we made. But when the wife and sister-in-law, sister-in-laws, say we should go to Chico, you go. And I'm glad I did, because if I didn't, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have uh, found the things that I found. So, first off, you saw this in the video uh, at that Walmart. So this would be Friday. I picked up Skelegod. I know a lot of people don't like it, but for twelve seventy five, not a bad deal. Um, I've seen this like you you saw this today or saw this today. Um, you're seeing this on Sunday, but Saturday, uh, you saw this at the Red Bluff Walmart for nineteen seventeen. I can't remember twenty somewhere in there. Uh, but yeah, for twelve seventy five, can not pass it up. I love this line. Um, I plan on taking this out, so there's a win. And then I go dropping shit already. Um, saw this too. I picked up Sabak, twenty bucks. I probably could have waited. Um, there is another one at Target, so I'm gonna wait. Probably check this coming week, see if it goes down, and then I'll just price match it. So glad to have that in the collection. Um, this is something I didn't show. I said I was gonna pick it up, and I did. I finally got my snake eyes and timber. Man, what a journey trying to find this some bitch. Um, twenty bucks or twenty two forty nine? I think I don't remember. Half off basically. Uh, but yeah, I've been looking for this, and to get it at that price was awesome. This is the last one I had. Uh, I did look. Uh, on the Target app, I think Thursday, and it showed they had six, and then to show up today, like, I was not expecting to go to Chico at all, and for them to have one left, lucky, it was meant to be, I guess, so yeah, happy to have that, I know, uh, it's just a repaint on both, but I didn't get the other version, and yeah, I like the box, so it looks cool, so happy to have that. I think this is the score of the day. Um, I've yet to see this in my Target. Probably won't see it now. Um, but yeah, $9.89 for movie Skeletor. Looks exactly like Frank Langella. Holy crap. I remember watching this when I was a kid and I loved that movie. And I still I still like it. Not as great now that I'm an adult. But still entertaining. Um, $9.89. A $32.99 figure. Which it shouldn't have been. This literally could have just been a normal $20 figure. But I know they did it because it's the movie and they want to hype around it. $9.89. That's crazy. And the fact that I found it the same day, I found this. But, yeah, it can't go wrong. But, yeah, this is not coming out. Um, I don't know. Maybe it will. I don't know. But, awesome. I need to find He-Man now. And I highly doubt I'm going to find it for $9.89, but hey, you never know. Uh, super stoked to have that. And then I got a box this week. This is from Art G. So make sure you guys follow him if you haven't already. So make sure you uh, subscribe to his channel. Like him on uh, Instagram or follow him on Instagram. So I already know what this is, but he did me a huge favor. And my target never got this figure. And they had it on clearance for $10.99. And man, oh man, Art, thank you very, very much for hooking me up and helping me out. I got the new Eternia Stratos. And there's the price, $10.99. So awesome. So happy to have this. Looks good. Another one for the collection. And now I just need to get Roboto. So if you guys can help me out, if you find a Roboto for Ten ninety nine or less. Let me know. Reach out. I will PayPal you, Cash App you, Venmo you, Zelle you if I have to. If you have Chime Bank, I'll send you money via, via Chime. So yeah, so that's the haul for this week. Normally I do a, I don't do a haul video, 
But I figured, you know what? Why not? These are awesome. This is such a great haul that I got. I'm so stoked about the Skeletor. Super happy about the uh, Snake Eyes and Timber. The Sabak's cool. The Skeletor's awesome. Just amazing, amazing stuff. Um, I also picked up some cards. Some football cards. Because I was looking for those Avengers ones. Nowhere to be found. And I did a uh, two shorts on these football cards. You know, I got some... You know, whatever. Decent hits. But this is the one. It's the uh, class president Peyton Manning. It's pretty uh, It's pretty nice. But yeah. Um, it's worth like five bucks or something. Or it sells for five bucks. I don't remember. But it's kind of thick. So I gotta, I gotta get a top. Uh, gotta get a top loader. And then this Derrick Henry. Which is pretty cool. It's the Pacific insert. It's worth a couple bucks. And then there's a couple other ones in here that I got. This is what I thought was funny when I opened this pack. So the first card I got. Well, I think it was like the third card. Second card, I can't remember. Russell Wilson. As you know, I'm a Seahawks fan. <laughs> So former quarterback, and then the card right behind him was his backup, and now starter Geno Smith. How funny is that? Um, what else did I get? I got a Debo red, red uh, parallel. I think that's what they call these. I don't remember. And a Justin Fields. Can't freaking do this right. Apparently, Justin Fields. And those are only worth a couple bucks, and. The gotta go through here. I got a Jalen Hurts, which is cool, and a Dallas Goddard. So any Eagle fans are interested, let me know. So come to find out, two rookies from the Detroit Lions in this pack. So Josh, what's his name? Pascal, and then I got Aiden Hutchinson. They were back to back, literally. So. They're worth, uh, what did it say? I want to say like a couple bucks, maybe. Two or three bucks each. So I pretty much paid for this pack. Um, if I decide to sell these, I don't know if I will. And then here's your starting quarterback for the Falcons, Desmond Ritter, which I think will have a good year since his last year's rookie year. Kind of hoping that one was a couple bucks, and this one, this Patrick Sertain, the second, the franchise future, that one was like a dollar or two. The press proof of Chase Young, the blue, so you can see like that blue, I don't know what they call these cards. That one, the regular version of this card, his common card, which is the same picture, was going for four, and this one wasn't listed on eBay. So I'll probably list it and see. Um, but yeah, and then this Sam Howell. This rated rookie Sam Howell. Blue. That one was like a buck, buck or two. But yeah, that's it for this week. That was the haul, like I said. And again, thank you guys for watching the video, subscribing, liking, commenting. I love when you guys comment. Um, I like commenting back. I like having conversation through uh, YouTube comments. It's awesome. And let's see what else is going on. So this coming week, so this is coming out Sunday, which is when you're watching this right now, or on Sunday. Um, Monday at 6 p.m. Pacific Time, 9 Eastern Time, I will be on Art G's channel. We're going to do a live unboxing of... Let me see if I can grab it. Without knocking anything over. So we're going to do a card breaks on this Fleer 22 Ultra Avenger cards. So we're going to be doing that on Monday. So that would be these cards right here. So I got some hits. I don't know if I showed you guys this before. But I got the Checkmate Hero Pawn. Vision. I got a medallion four, which is pretty rad. And these are thick cards. I don't know if you can tell, but look how thick these are. 
So this Thor, which is rad, and I put this one in a sleeve. Ultra Stars Wonder Man. This is the only one I could put in a sleeve because these things are so freaking thick. And then I got green uh, parallels of Iron Man and Howard the Duck. These actually look really nice. And then the rarer one was this Ultra Power Black Panther. So, pretty awesome. So I'm excited to do that with uh, Art and I can't remember who the other gentleman that we're uh, going to be ripping cards open with. So that'll be on his channel on Monday, 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 Eastern Time. Then the following day on Tuesday, Overgrown 30 Gators podcast. Um, this is kind of like a special podcast. So Tuesdays are going to be designated for, I guess, one-offs or uh, spotlights on people, collectors or different types of collectors and you know vinyl. It could be pops. It could be... Um, my Little Ponies. I don't, I don't know. So we're doing something a little different. Um, but this one is with Francis McGrath. If you watch Ethan Page's toy vlog hunt, or toy hunt vlog on YouTube, Francis McGrath, uh, I want to say this was in February. Ethan Page, uh, Smart Mark Sterling, and Brody King. So they go visit this place in Texas, I believe. Um... It's Star Wars. It's a Star Wars themed only store. That's all they have. Star Wars, everything. Um, man, I cannot think of what it's called, but it'll come to me probably later. Anyway, um, so Ethan was in this store with uh, the other two guys, and they he ends up buying wanting this old vintage. I think it's Return of the Jedi Han Solo. So he was trying to negotiate a price, and Francis was the uh, employee working the day at the time with uh i think one of the other managers so he had to so francis had to reach out to the owner and see if he can get it at a lower price come to find out in this video this toy vlog later ethan says the francis gets fired so big old mess and anyway so we're going to talk to him about that experience star wars toy collecting uh whatever else he does music and stuff so Go follow him on Instagram. He has a YouTube channel as well. So um, if you need a link to his page, it's tagged on the Overgrown Theaters podcast Instagram page. So follow him there. Then Thursday, the Overgrown Theaters podcast, our normal day, we are going to have, if I can remember correctly, because I have a lot of stuff going on this week, um, director... Studio head, I'm trying to think, producer, the all around nicest guy in the world, Justin Boss, excuse me, Justin Boswick, and his partner. Um, why can I not remember his name? Man, this is terrible. But anyway, they're going to be on the Overgrown Third Gage podcast on Thursday. How do I know him? So, Justin actually, uh, I reached out to Justin, I want to say a couple years ago, maybe a year or two ago, about uh, a TV show that my friend and I have written that we worked on for a long, long time. We sent it to him. He gave us notes back and forth, and we got to a point where we felt like we were really in a good place, and then Justin had to go out and film a movie and go shop it and try to sell it. So anyway... We're going to talk to him and his uh, partner about the new studio that they created and what they're trying to do and what's going on with them in general. So that's exciting. So I hope you guys tune in for that. The following Tuesday and Thursday, we have two new podcasts. So pretty much all of April, we're going to have two podcasts per week. I believe... At the end of April, the 25th, we have Mr. Fantastic's, um, we have Mr. Fantastic G's on the podcast. That might be the last podcast of April. Don't remember. Um, I don't know if we filled Thursday or not. So anyway, keep looking out. We'll announce everything on Overgrown 30 Gators podcast on that Instagram channel and on my Instagram as well. So anyway. Thank you again for watching. Hope you guys watch all the way through this. Because like 
60% of you guys, one, aren't subscribed and aren't watching all the way through the video, which I get. I watch everyone's video all the way through because I just like to see everything that, you know, that they put work into. So, please like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm trying to get to a thousand subs by June. Currently, I just looked tonight, I'm at 538 subs. Pretty crazy. And I am very appreciative that you guys keep subscribing, commenting, liking the videos. I know this is a long-winded end of the video, but anyway, please keep doing that. Share. Uh, you can follow me on TikTok. I'm trying to put more and more TikToks up. I've been doing more and more YouTube shorts. I'm on Twitter. I don't really tweet very much. I just tweet out stuff for Overground Theory Years podcast for the most part. Um, I think that's it. I think that's it. But yeah, I like I said, I appreciate you guys. Thank you very much for watching and continue watching. And until then, we'll see you on the next hunt. Oh man, my messy my messy desk. See, I do open stuff. Look at this. Got stuff everywhere. Had to put out pops out of my room. B-roll footage. This is a good pop.